Hey everyone, welcome back to a new and amazing After Effects tutorial. Today we're going to create this awesome text follow path animation from scratch. This tutorial is completely beginner friendly and I'll guide you through the step-by-step -step process. So make sure you watch till the end. And before we start, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get started. Open After Effects. Let's make a new composition to call it Text Holder. Set the size to a 16 by 9 ratio, then press OK. Now select the text tool and write your desired text. I'll write this text here. Press Ctrl plus R to enable the rulers and use guides to make perfect stroke lines. Center align the text using the Align tool. With the text layer selected, choose the Pen tool and draw a mask line around the guides like this. Adjust it carefully to get a perfect line. Now select the pen tool again, deselect the text layer, set the fill to none, and set the stroke to around 120. Create a random shape like this. Next, select the text layer, press M for mask, select the mask, then go to the edit panel and choose copy with property links or just press Ctrl plus Alt plus C. Then select the shape layer, search for its path property, and paste the mask path onto it by pressing Ctrl plus V. Now, here's the good part. The shape will move along the text mask path. Go under the text layer properties, then to path options, and set the path to mask one. Now the text will follow the mask path. Select the shape layer, click on add and choose trim path. Create keyframes on the end and start values and also on the first margin and last margin options in the text layer. Do the same for the mask path too. Drag all these keyframes to one second and 15 frames in the timeline. At the beginning, set the end value of trim path to zero and decrease the last margin value until the text goes out of the composition like this. Now set the first margin and start value keyframes here for some continuous movement in the animation. Then go to two seconds and 15 frames Increase the first margin value until the text goes out of the composition. And set the start value of the trim path to 100. Next, adjust the mass path handles at the ending keyframe like this. And at the beginning, like this. Select all keyframes, press F9 to easy ease them, and adjust the graph like this. Now, Duplicate this layer and hide the duplicated layers for now. We'll need to link the paths again. Select these two layers and search for path. Delete the existing shape path keyframes. 
Then select the mask path and choose copy with property links and paste it into the second shape layers path using control plus V. Add keyframes on the mask path again and adjust the handles at the beginning like this. and at the ending, like this. Easy ease these keyframes and adjust the graph like this. Now, change the text to whatever you want. Duplicate these two layers one more time and place them behind all layers. We'll make this one straight. Link the mask path with the shape path again, just like before. Press Ctrl plus Alt plus C to copy the mask path with property links and paste it onto the shape layer path. Then select the mask path and make it straight using the guide tool like this. Change the text as you want. Now unhide all the layers. Change the color of the shape strokes like this. I have already chosen some color codes, but you can use any color. Apply the drop shadow effect on the first shape layer and increase the softness to add some depth to the lines. Duplicate this effect and paste it onto the second shape layer as well. This is how the animation looks so far. Now go to the project panel and make a new composition. Call it main comp. Drag and drop the text holder component onto it. Duplicate this layer in the timeline and also in the project panel. In the duplicate text holder layer, hide all the text layers. Then hold Alt and swap this layer with text holder 2. Apply the find edges effect. Click on invert, offset it by one frame and increase the scale to 105. And this is the final animation we'll get. This is how you can create a text following shape path animation. You can use your own creativity to make something cool with it. If you enjoyed this tutorial, don't forget to hit like and subscribe. It really helps the channel and make sure you won't miss future tutorials. And if you'd like to support my work and get access to the premium project file, check out my Kofi page. The link is in the description. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you in the next tutorial.